Hello, my sexy niggers. It is I, Ronald McDonald, also known as the Penis Clown. And today I'm gonna tell the truth about this awful game that is already dead on arrival, which is not surprising since the game sucks dinosaur balls. I am talking about the one and only Counter Strike 2. The supposed new Valve game that has nothing new to offer. Like, holy cow, I feel pity for these PC elitists that were fooled by their own hype, because all this slop is in a graphics update with some new menu features, which should have been there since the release of CSGO, which sucks balls as well. I guarantee you the only losers who will pick this up are these Cheeto Breath, 300 kilogram, Virgin for Life, looking like Gabe and Newell motherfuckers, that surprisingly can walk to the kitchen for hamburger. Counter-Strike 2 should be renamed to Camper Snore 2, because this game is nothing but a wait for some sucker to go into your crosshair and press mouse 1. If you think that Counter-Strike as a franchise is good first-person shooter then you are the type of person to watch dry paint on a Friday night. Listen if you have IQ score higher than single digits you would have known the superior FPS, which is no other than the Call of Duty franchise. Call of Duty is the real man FPS. Call of Duty is for the ones with hair on their chest, and are not afraid to fight a fucking polar bear in the woods. And no I'm not talking about that kiddie garbage like Warzone, but the peak FPS that is advanced warfare. Yes the game that is perfect for us higher level thinkers, with its engaging gameplay, beautiful graphics that hard stomps Counter Strike 2 on a daily basis. Get support from console, and we all know the history of Valve and console. They fucking abandoned Counter-Strike for the console not even one year after release. We can say the same for Team Fortress 2 on Xbox 360, not even one year after release, and still got fucking abandoned like a stray dog. Honest I find it absurd that they cater towards their PC cult that feed them money. But you know what sets gold apart from dirt? Unlike Counter-Strike 2, Call of Duty is actual fun. Meanwhile the only dopamine you can get from Counter-Strike is the unboxing of loot boxes, which introduced this industry to microtransactions. I bet my 20 cents y'all Malvitards forgot about that didn't you? And why is it that Overwatch 2 gets backlash for being the same game, but when it's Counter-Strike 2 does it you clowns build a fucking golden statue for what exact? Responsive volumetric smokes. 128 tick servers. The max rounds are now 12, instead of 15 meanwhile you play the same shoddy game in Dust 2. Are your standards so fucking low that this gets you hyped? Remember when sequels actual changed something? Despite how trash Overwatch is, at least they added some new characters, which are fucking terrible, but hey I can at least see some effort. I already heard much complaints about the performance issues on low-end PCS. And I'm questioning how the fuck they want those guys to play this slop. With what a Steam Deck? I wouldn't even wipe my bum with the Steam Deck. Hell if you trying to offer me a Steam Deck for free, I would take it, just to sell it to some low IQ sucker, because I know the fact that the Steam Deck is made with the cheapest materials from China that will break the moment, and I'm not joking the fucking moment the clock strikes midnight on the day after your warranty expires. And I guarantee you I won't be the only one that would experience that. Listen to me close of you like Counter-Strike 2, repent as soon as possible, and I will repeat saying that until you do the deed. Because this game is truly invested with wrath, envy, sloth, and so on. And they are very noticeable due to the average Counter-Strike player behavior. So in conclusion fuck Counter-Strike 2, fuck Valve, and most important fuck UCS fanboys. Lucky there won't be a third Counter-Strike dot because Valve has yet to learn to count to three. Ahahahahahahaha. <laughs> but alright enough about this garbage game I bet this video has made you hungry didn't it? Well come over to McDonald and if you use the code Jameson, you get a 20% off discount for my world famous Mac Cock Sandwich. Yes. The cock meat sandwich consists of Richard Simmons' Harry Dick, which I cut off since he grows a new one every 10 minutes. He screams in pain because he loses a lot of blood when we chop off his cock, but don't worry he is into it. The sandwich will be topped with some pig blood and cummy mustard, which is made from a mixture of bit of puke of my semen. We toast it at 69 degree and a couple cummies optimal for dipping.
So come down to McDonald's and try out this amazing sandwich today. Bye you sexy frogs.